shot a little too fast. <clears throat> and I got powder in my eye. That sucks. Yeah, it's still fun. Got to shoot at him. Keep walking up the hill here. Maybe the third time will be a charm. Unreal. I just missed one off and at 25 yards. The screen almost looks fogged up. Anyway. Just a small one, but it was laying there 25 yards. The whole time in my head, I'm like, I just need one stupid yearling to lay for me, looking at me for a good offhand shot. And I still missed it. So I'm going to go back up through here one more time, and then I'm going home. And I'm going to practice the living heck out of shooting this thing, because I'm sick of missing. I think I missed. One, two, this season. One, last season. Two last season, that's four. And then before I missed last five. I think I missed five deer now with a flintlock. Didn't even hit them. Missed them clean. So, keep at it here. Now I just shot for the middle of that. And somehow, I got over my flinching because there's my round ball pancaked. I mean, that's 30 yards offhand. And I tell you what, I'm so happy I got over the flinching. I just hope it doesn't come back. <laughs> well, that went pretty good. Let's do it again. Shoot a piece of wood this time. Tell you what. That's what happens when you're able to look through the shot. I mean, you see how big that circle is. I shoot 3F. I shoot uh, 70 grains of 3F out of my 54 caliber. I shoot a 15,000th patch with a 530 round ball. And I tried. Uh, what, three different patch thicknesses, try a couple different round ball sizes, and that's what I settled on. Which is great, because a 530 is common as heck, and so is a 15,000th patch, so that's what seemed to shoot the best out of the gun. So. And I just got my first one with the flint lock. Well, finally did it. 54 caliber Petterzoli Blue Ridge flintlock. Shot a doe down here where I grew up in 5B, uh, Adams County. And uh, shot it right through the shoulder, about 20 yards offhand. So it's my eighth time shooting at a deer with a flintlock, and it finally came together. But Dad pushed him up to me. Thank you, Dad, for pushing. I have a little thicket here, and uh, we've always had deer, but we never get shooting. <laughs> so finally had success for doing this drive in the late season. It's the Saturday after Christmas and I couldn't be more happy. So get some baloney made and finally some successful flintlock in the late season.